This building is filled with our neighbors and friends. But first tonight at six, pulling back the veil. Amazon shows off its brand new fulfillment center in North Randall, built on the footprint of a shuttered mall. The massive facility that serves Cleveland and beyond employs more than 2,000 people and thousands of robotic helpers. It sure does. News 5's Jordan Vandenberg shows us how it all works. The mayor North Randall says when the Amazon Fulfillment Center project was in its earliest days, he codenamed it Operation Goliath. And perhaps it's a fitting moniker because it is a giant part of this community now. In this world of whizzing metal and cardboard is the engine that keeps it humming. The people are its pistons. You're going to see some of our associates right up front. And the machines are its transmission. You can see behind me on each of these four floors, we have thousands of Amazon robots, which are the orange boxes on the bottom of the inventory storage shelves. Side by side, man and machine work together, filling orders before forwarding them. The relationship has to be symbiotic to do what Amazon does best. Amazon has always been focused when we introduce technology on making our associates jobs safer and more productive. So the robots, for instance, will bring the product to the associate to eliminate the need for the associate to walk through the warehouse to find that product. Quickly after opening in September 2018, the 850,000 square foot North Randall Fulfillment Center became fully operational by the holiday season, employing 2,000 people in deploying thousands of robots in the process. The economic and social impact cannot be understated, officials say. The cost is far greater to do nothing than it is to make sure that people have a chance. And it's almost hard to believe that just a few years ago. It means everything. This sprawling campus was a shuttered shopping mall, a liability instead of an asset. I nicknamed this community the Sleeping Giant. The nickname for this coal project was Goliath. Uh, and Goliath has been awakened. Uh, we're doing very well as a community. We're well respected now when in, in the past we were not. This building is really a launching pad for a lot of associates to take their career and their lives in the direction that they choose. Amazon also presented a $20,000 check to Warrensville Heights City Schools to go toward their technology and STEAM education learning. Reporting from North Randall, Jordan Vandenberg, News 5.